Hello everyone, Lono here, back with some more things on the internet, because that's what we do, and do you like games? I love games. I mean, I obviously have the complexion of a mod redditor that have been unleashed upon the world from its dungeon. And I can own that. I do know that I have the complexion of a fedora wielder. <laughs> do not worry, my lady. I have the power of God and anime at my side. <laughs> because today we're gonna be checking out two different videos of two vastly different games. I mean, technically, I guess they can have something overlapping, because both involve monsters. One involves zombies, and one involves monsters. Because there's two short videos, I decided, instead of making two separate videos, I decided... Well, you know what? I baked both in here today, because I'm a big fan of both games. Because one game is Seven Days to Die, because they have now finally released the 1.0 game. You know, it is finally actually released out of alpha after so, so many years. And I've been playing Seven Days to Die for a very long time. It is actually the game I played most on my Steam account. And it is a game I have fond memories playing with my friends and everyone, you know, and I have been streaming. It's generally one of my comfort games. So it's amazing to see that it's still like making updates for it and uh, you know uh, doing so much with it i think that is amazing and it makes me so happy to see how much the game have changed over the years and they now of course have a gameplay trailer which we're going to be checking out because I'm, I'm curious to see how that will look like uh, in trailer wise and the other video we're going to be checking out is monster prom 4 monster con seriously the monster prom series is amazing if you haven't played them you fucking should get your friends in and just have a go at it i've been uh, playing this a lot with my uh, well my my siblings and my friends it, it is such a fun game and it is so just whack and over the top and i do have all monster prom games well up to four now. Well, four have not been released yet, but it's a reveal teaser we're gonna be checking out the other day. And I'm excited for that, because that is definitely something I will be getting in the future when it comes out, because yes! More Monster Prime, I'm always game for that. So let's jump right into this and have ourselves a little look. And you know what? As a treat, or a punishment, depending on how you're looking at it, we're gonna be checking out uh, just a few, few moments of my old video of Seven Days to Die, and compilation video I made well, apparently eight years ago, so it is very old, and it was at, uh, well, around the time I started streaming, I mean, I have probably done it for a year or so back then, so I, I thought, you know what, why not do that and see the changes of the game as, well, uh, you know, Seven Days to Die, and uh, oh my god, I had the red-green hair, half was red and half was green, I actually wanted red and blue, because, you know, red versus blue, I thought it was gonna be funny. And uh, the problem is, though, my hair is such color that the, the blue actually turned green. Which was okay, because in the end it was Christmas time, so it looks like a Christmas tree ejaculated on my head. So it worked well. And my god, I, I have gained weight since then. Oh my god. And the thing is, I thought I was super fat back then. Now I am super fat. I mean, maybe not super fat, but... I'm big boy. Well, sometimes you just question yourself. How the hell did they build the buildings? Oh, God. How did they do this? I'm quite amazed. Uh, oh, gosh. How the hell did they do this? That's an amazing glitch. Talk about... Uh, wonder if... yeah, I probably oh. will break... Oh, I can go on there. I probably shouldn't do that, but I gotta do that yeah. anyway. Because I'm an idiot is it... and I like to explore. Well, this looks... Is quite it that tree I'm holding it up? The bottom side looks under a house and all that. And now my satisfaction is still. What the fuck? Hey, there's zombies up. Oh, fuck. Hey, no, no. Oh, God, this is so cringe. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, things have changed quite a lot since then. Uh, yes. So that is why we're going to be checking out the trailer and we're going to be doing it here on their Twitter. The fun beams is proud to present our 1.0 gameplay trail. This trail showcases how far the game has come and how the 1.0 version looks today. And I'm excited for that. Because, yes, Seven Days to Die is... Oh, God, I love it. I love survival crafting games in general. Like, well, Minecraft and stuff like that, of course. 
Uh, it, 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 it's something that tickles my fancy because when I'm playing it with my friends, we we always finding like we have different positions. I am the loot goblin, you know. I'm going out exploring and finding like m materials and bring it back to base. And my 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 broski Lorenzo, he's like the one that is building and stuff. And yeah, you know, we we all finding our little spots and our little speciality. So. Making me think of that entire like wall that I'm making me think of layers of fears. <laughs> oh, that's less so. Oh my god! I can't remember it being so fucking creepy. Jesus! Damn. And the game have come a long way. I love the music and everything. Holy crap. This battle is like built like that, I gotta take a while. <laughs> Indeed. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Howdy, okay. Survivor. That was a cool building right there. Nasty. That's just some new armor. This is so good! Oh yeah! Oh my god! Yes, the blood moon. Blood moons are so fucking just messing me up. My god. I still have a memory. It was many years ago, and me and my cousin were playing this, and I remember we were playing around, and the blood moon came. But for so I think it was a blood moon at least, but instead of zombies, it was wolves that came running. And. We were trying to get up on a building. I managed to get up on the building to get away from the wolves, but my cousin were like, oh, no, no! And then I just saw him getting shomped to death by the wolves. A big pack of wolves. That, that was my god. And the longer you last, you know, the m more days you are, the bigger the ho and stronger the horde gets, which makes sense. And I remember playing for a very long time on the server, and... Um, that was a lot of zombies, uh, then, I gotta say. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I haven't seen that with a car. Oh, no, that is... God. Heck, yeah. Oh, baby. I'm scared on Blood Moons. I wish someone could stay the night. Oh. Well, that won't be me, because I, I, I will be hiding in a hole. <laughs> but yeah, oh my god, it is amazing to see how much this game have changed over the years. One mechanic I remember that was in the game, there was that when you carry meat, uh, zombies could smell it. You like raw meat, so if you had it, the zombies could smell it. I think they removed that uh, because it was kind of like, you know. I guess it was because it was kind of obnoxious when you were carrying a random piece of meat and the zombies like, <laughs> and stuff like, seriously though, they had gone through so much. And I think that is what's make is amazing that even if you have been in alpha for so long, it's not be been because they haven't done anything with the game. They've actually done a lot with the game. And I think that is what makes it so fun to play. And the changes, I mean, no, not all changes are like fantastic or something like that, but it still makes the game feel fresh and exciting, you know? They're adding new stuff and new items and new mechanics. They update the models, you know? It is just... Yeah, like the zombie that we saw in the beginning here. Uh, yeah, that... I mean, seriously! That looking freaky as fuck! Holy shit. So, yeah, this is, like, seriously, it's such an awesome game. I need to play this more. Do some more collabs as well. Man. Seriously, I do hope we're getting... Something I would actually like is maybe some other biome that is just very whack. Maybe like sci-fi or something like that. Just, just for the heck of it, you know. Like a random thing you can add if you want to. 
Though, of course, it's better to focus on the main game and everything, but still. And, yeah. There is so many cool things with this game. If you haven't played it, you should try it. Uh, if you have interest in these kind of games, play it with your friends. It's super fun, so, yeah. And then we have Monster Prom 4 Monster Con reveal teaser. Oh my god, I'm excited for this. Holy crap. I love Monster Prom games. They, 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 it is so fun to play with, you, with your friends and everything. And uh, Monster Con, okay. I never been to a con, uh, though we are talking about going to Narcon here in Sweden this year, actually. So I, I hope that would happen. That would be really fun. So we're gonna see about that. But for now, though, we're gonna check this Monster Con. Let's go do the gun, come on, monsters bring it on, it's time to make it fun, it's hey! time to make it right, I said it, let's go do the gun, nothing can stop us, and you know, we're gonna make it right, we're gonna make it whole, there oh. are the stands, come oh, he's a mimic, dog, let me pick up your stand, number one fan, this oh, is our chance, there's a romance, there is nothing you can do, oh my, monster, 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 yeah, I'm a nerd, I'm a weeb, everybody club with me, I love the dances as well. There's so many mean dances in here. <laughs> Oh god, first of all, the song is so catchy, my god. And there's so many new characters. I mean... Yeah, April there. I, I can see that uh, many firsts for this one. Definitely. And oh man... Yeah, he looks like the, t the edgelord. Doomsday upon Jay. La. <laughs> then dog... I guess it's supposed to be an, uh, what do you call it? Slime, you know? I like it, Look, it's looking pudgy, I like it. And then Nico, oh, it's okay. I love this, a Mimic? That is, I, I never thought about that, actually. That is awesome. God, this game is so cool. I, I can't wait for this. It's gonna be so fun. I know me and Eliza are definitely gonna play this. Ah, the classic D and D. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait for this. This is gonna be super fun. Oh my god! But yes, that will be for now, though. And I hope you enjoy this as much as I do. And of course, go support the creators of these two really awesome games. And we will see you next time. And continue to have a super great day. <laughs>